from Miami-Dade, Broward, and the Keys. This is South Florida's CBS4 News. Well, it happens to the best of us. Two-thirds of American men will experience hair loss by age 35. However, a new robotic procedure is coming to their rescue. Less than 15 of these machines exist in the U.S. One of them is in Miami. CBS 4's Vanessa Board shows you what makes the high-tech hair transplant so special. Dr. Paul Rose is helping men confront their fear of losing their hair face first. It's a robot to the rescue. It's called the artist system. It plucks out healthy hair follicles and puts them back into areas of a patient's head that are going bald. Yeah, I had like the, the crown, I had lost my hair. This 26-year-old South Floridian, we'll call him Jose to protect his identity, is going under the needle. Well, um, I noticed that I started losing my hair about like that, uh, when I was 22, 23 years old. If I lose it like when I'm 50, 60, it's okay. You know, it's a natural process. It happens, but not so young. All the hair on the back of Jose's head was grafted out. The healthy hair follicles are chosen at random. It can take hours. After they are individually cleaned and prepped, those hairs are then implanted back onto the top of his head. It looks painful, but the patient is under local anesthesia. Actually, throughout the process, I didn't feel any pain at all. This tedious procedure used to be done by hand. It could take uh, three or four hours to harvest, uh, let's say, 1,500 grafts. With the robot, that could be half the time. In the traditional procedure, a piece of the scalp is cut off and sewn back together. With the artist, there are no scars. I always like to wear my, my hair like short. So I have that possibility after this procedure without having any scars or anything. Jose's hair should grow back thicker in the next six months. I'm sure that when I have my full hair back, I'm, I'm going to feel better about myself. But the artist system is an expensive choice. It can cost from six to $15,000, and it's not FDA approved for women, at least not yet. Vanessa Borge, CBS4 News. He said it's not painful, but it looks like... He's it getting his be. hair, if yes. it works. Yeah. That's what he wants. Next in sports...